Well, British Heart Foundation Northern Ireland has teamed up with the Department of Culture, Arts and Leisure and Sport in line to raise awareness about a really, really important of strengthening the chain of survival. So basically, uh, BHF Northern Ireland strongly believes in creating a nation of lifesavers. So we provide free CPR training to communities and to schools, post-primary schools right across Northern Ireland. Well, basically today, um, we've brought a number of really, really key people from the sporting world in Northern Ireland together to help raise awareness about this, and especially about the importance of CPR training. So uh, there'll be uh, sports heroes from right across the country will be taking a few minutes, 30 minutes basically, to learn how to save a life using our Compush Rescue equipment. Well, it's very important. Uh, you only have to see some of the people that are actually here uh, who dedicate themselves to uh, not only getting the time up, but training other people. I was actually speaking to a guy who there is he's actually now the poster boy who had an incident when he was 22. Yeah, he's about 32 now, so 10 years ago. And, but for people being trained in CPR, you know, he probably wouldn't be here because the ratio is as soon as you have an issue. Uh, the percentage is very low of survival, so this is great that you know, it helps people uh, not only learn how to train, but hopefully save other people. Eight years ago, I was at the uh, Banyo Leisure Centre, working for a Taekwondo class, on what kind of day, felt a bit lightheaded, went over to my bag to get my water bottle, and before I knew that I was uh, unconscious. Um, a few minutes later, it came around, and it turned out that the uh, experience of sudden cardiac arrest. Um, thankfully, there was two of the Leisure Centre staff members in the room next door, who were CPR trained, uh, and uh, they were able to perform that on me. Uh, also, the Leisure Centre was equipped with um, automatic external Defibrillator. So the combination of the CPR and the defibrillator, thankfully, was able to, to bring you around and uh, uh, effectively save my life. Yeah, so it's uh, very important, uh, important to have this kind of event. Um, CPR is an uh, essential life skill. It doesn't take particularly long to learn and you can use it throughout your life. Uh, hopefully you'll never have to use it, but you can learn within 30 to 60 minutes and uh, it's a skill that will could potentially save somebody's life and uh, it's something that we should really focus on and get people involved with. Obviously the, the British Heart Foundation, this uh, initiative that they're starting to promote uh, CPR and first responders in the community is vitally important because obviously if anyone drops and takes a heart attack, time is of the essence so the, the more people that you have that are trained and capable of carrying out CPR as soon as possible, the better the outcome is for, for the person.